I know I've been hearing a lot of talk on TV about green jobs. When in Newark, we're not just talk, we're actually doing it. Yeah. You know? yeah. And thanks to Cory Booker, Gain, the lady who's joining once again, for giving me the opportunity and training, but also they're giving me a future. Amen. Because a job without dignity, a job without security, a job without benefits, a job without a pension is not a job. It's not what we yearn for and look for and deserve as Americans. So now here we have a number of wins. We're going to help families in the city of Newark. We're going to keep our environment improving. We're going to save energy. We're going to create jobs, but more importantly than that, we are going to create careers for Newark residents. Yeah. We went to Ross in this house for as the weather strips, try to save money for the economy and the environment. And senior citizens, they live on a fixed income. They don't have much money, so we're trying to do this weather relations to the houses for free. They keep the heat in, cold out. You know, something for them to look forward to, you know, in the long run. Save the homeowner money. It's going to create some jobs, possibly stimulate the local economy a little bit. Okay, because if we eliminate this thing cycling on and off, if we eliminate heat loss, it will save the homeowner money. These houses that we're weatherizing, nine times out of ten, they're older homes. Okay, they shift, doors swell, contract, and there's gaps. And, and the most thing is you have air coming in. It's outside outlets and switches on the walls. Believe it or not, drafts will come through the uh, those little fixtures. So we're trying to eliminate the drafts there. We're actually stopping that air flow from coming in. So in the summer, so in the winter time, you keep the air out. But in the summertime, if you have air conditioning, you're keeping the cold air in. We wrapped this hot water tank. It eliminates heat loss from the tank. They've insulated some of the pipes, but you see some of these the newer insulation. I like this. Same thing. The hot water has got to come from this tank to go to the faucets and stuff. Okay. If, if it stays hot from here to there, less this has to run. The heater, hot water and steam. If it stays hot in the pipes, getting to where it's got to go, less that this will have to run and the heat will be able to do what it has to do in the rooms. We're weather stripping windows and doors, caulking some of the windows. Same thing, it's eliminating drafts, eliminating heat loss. The less this stuff has to run, the less money these people have to pay. The challenges that we have right now are challenges to our moral imagination. Can we see a way out of no way? Can we turn obstacles into opportunities, barriers into blessings, pitfalls into pools of potential? And this is the challenge that we have before us. And today, in screaming testimony, we are saying to the world, we're saying to America, we're saying to the state of New Jersey and to all of Newark, that Newark, New Jersey is going to be on the forefront of turning a challenged economy, high unemployment rate, a terrible uh, uh, environmental record into the forefront of the green era to come.